Hello veggies. It is a brand new day. It's actually a brand new month. It is November the 1st. So in this video, I went grocery shopping, but I'm just going to show you guys what I'm not going to say struggling looks like, but you know, the prices of food has went up. So I'm going to show you all what I was able to grab for $12.50. I stopped at Aldi's and just picked up a few things that I needed in my uh, refrigerator. So the first thing I picked up were these fresh green beans. And I was going to get a bag of frozen, but the fresh were cheaper than the frozen. So I went with the fresh ones. I bought two bags of broccoli. So you guys should know. Sonia loves broccoli. I can eat broccoli like all by itself, like a dessert. <laughs> I got two cans of tomato soup. Well, I guess it would be like the base. You know, you add water to it. You can add extra things like oregano, basil, dill to salt, you know, to spice it up. I bought think of celery because I'm going to be juicing some celery juice this week. Uh, that would be healthy for the upcoming winter months. I got a bag of sweet potatoes. You guys, I love sweet potatoes. I really do. I like to make sweet potato fries. I like to boil a sweet potato and make a sweet, you know, like a baked sweet potato. I got some gala apples. They were on sale for $1.99. Those sweet potatoes also were $1.99. So my fruit basket, as you can see, is empty. I only had like two oranges. I have garlic and a thing of um, ginger. So I'm just blowing it out so I can get ready to add my gala apples. You guys know I'm very big on cleaning off my fruits and vegetables very, very well. I always rinse them really, really good. <coughs> Excuse me. And then I will also scrub them and add a little cleaning solution. So, yeah, I'm going to also clean these green beans as well. So, guys, I hope you all have been eating yourself well to better health. Upcoming winter months, it gets so cold. You have to get a lot of vitamin C in your diet. So, yeah. I still haven't invested, y'all, in a uh, scissor, kitchen scissors, but I will in the meantime. But I'm just going to go ahead, insert both of these bags of broccoli into a bigger bag so I can put them in the freezer. And that way I don't have to keep cutting, you know, digging out of one bag, going into another. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm just going to form these two packages together to make one and it just makes it easier on you as a person and it just makes it easier in your life I like to do things in my life that makes my life easier in every form fashion so you guys will see here that it will be easier to just open one bag versus two bags The only thing about going to the grocery store is you have a lot of packaging. So you you guys will see how much packaging I will have. But this is currently what $12.50 will get you. So now it's time for me to rinse off my, um, I think put the green beans in this container here. This is like a strainer. And I tend to just um, pour any produce that I have in there, soak it with water for a couple of minutes. Sometimes it could be up to 15 minutes, but I like to run my water first because they all, I'm, I don't know where I heard this from, but I've heard, and you guys can let me know in the comments that when you turn on your faucet water, if it's not filtered, to let it run for a little while. So that is what I tend to usually do. Um, this celery here, I'm just going to take it out the package. I'm not going to too much uh, deal with it right now, but I usually just cut off the butt so I can throw it outside in the yard because I have a friendly rabbit, you guys. Yes, I have a friendly rabbit pet, a real live wild rabbit that likes to hide underneath the deck and come out. And when I throw stuff out, it will come out and eat it. So I'm grateful for, to do that. 
So this is where I'm putting all my plastics, like I said, for recycle. And later on in the evening, if I go back out to ride my bike or something, I will just take the bag and empty and recycle. So this is how much I got right now. So a little bit after this, I probably will find more and um, put in the bag. So I'm gonna just take this white vinegar and pour a little bit on my apples, sweet potatoes, and inside the green beans. And like I said, I let things soak, I wash them off, and then I get ready to put them where they need to go. Everything has to have some type of organization. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm doing here. So pretty soon, those beans will be able to be put in a bag and stored in the freezer until I get ready to use them. So my apples are clean, freshly washed, scrubbed. And let's go ahead and add them to my beautiful field bowl. Y'all, I love this stone. Um, it's like a stone bowl, and I absolutely love it. I got it from the bins, and guys, I only paid one dollar. No, no, no. I got it from the Goodwill on, for my birthday as a gift for myself. <laughs> I had to go back and remember now. Go back and watch Simply Natural Black Life, and it's on there. But it was like two dollars so it's time to go ahead and put our sweet potatoes in the uh, crisper so I still have like three regular uh, russet potatoes left over from my last trip to Audis so I'm just storing the sweet potatoes behind it so once those are gone I can rotate my sweet potatoes so I go from the front to the back and that is how I dis distri distribute and eat my food so it doesn't go bad okay so that's what our sweet potatoes look like from the russet to the sweet potatoes so i'll go from front left to right and back all right guys so i have stretched out my 12 dollars. okay so right now we are in the kitchen i love the fact that my fruit bowl is looking very well stocked now i absolutely love it y'all it's so pretty the ceramic and the simplicity is everything. So you guys know I have a new cookware set called Karoot, and I got rid of some utensils. I had too many in there. So the, the cookware came with one of these ones I'm showing you with this wood and uh, silicone. So I decided to get rid of, of these black salad tongs and bowl and spoon. I'm just gonna donate it to the woman's shelter, let someone else that's going to be moving into their own place have a nice set of utensils. So, yeah, guys, that's going to um, pretty much do it for me. Um, that's all my let goes for the kitchen. And I'm just going to leave you with this. Always remember to eat yourself well to better health. Okay? I will see you guys in the next one. Mwah.